Welcome back to my channel, my crystal kings and queens. So today I'm just going to be doing a quick crystal haul, of course. Um, I'm really, really excited about doing this because I went to the crystal shop and I definitely did not expect to pick up the crystals that I did. However, they are about the same type of crystals that I generally get. I'm just excited to show you because I just think they look so gorgeous and I've just been so antsy to go ahead and do this. So let's get on into the video. If you are new to my channel, welcome my new crystal kings and queens. And to each and every one of you, thank you so much for rocking with me. Thank you so much for supporting me. And I just can't wait to continue to grow um, through all of this. This journey has just been so amazing and you all have been so amazing. So I want to thank each and every one of you for that. And if you have not already, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe as well. Check out my blog site at royallabyrinth.com. Enjoy the video. Okay, so for my first three crystals, I have three Oko geodes. I actually gave away to our subscriber giveaway winner um, an Oko geode. And um, I just absolutely hope she enjoys it as much as I did picking them out and I'll go ahead and show you this first so the subscriber winner for our last giveaway Miss Tasha Giles she actually has the bigger half to this Oko geode and Oko geodes are meant um, as friendship stones so you keep one half and you give away the other to a special someone or someone you care about, someone you love. And I did just that. So I'm really, really happy with my choice and um, purchasing this and it was just so pretty. And though she has the bigger version, it has many more crystals within it, but they're all both um, just as beautiful together. And this little beauty is mine, so. Enjoy that wonderful little beauty. So that's the first one. My second one, I could not resist buying this. This was just so pretty. It reminded me of a fairy cave, just as much as the blue one did as well. But I'm like, if I was a little fairy, I would really live in one of these. So pretty. I didn't even bother to show the back, but this is what the back looks like. So that's the bigger version of these two geodes. And this is the smaller version, which is also very, very pretty. I love this, just the shimmer, the way the crystals sparkle Sometimes I just really honestly believe that crystals are worth way more than diamonds. Like they say diamonds are or di <laughs> Y'all I'm about to start acting trippy. <laughs> Maybe it's the incense and all the smoke coming. But um no really they say diamonds are a you know woman's best friend, but crystals are mine, so I love this. So pretty. All right. Next we have, I'm sorry y'all, like I have to grab these from um, behind me because they're resting in a very interesting location. But next we have fluorite. So these are fluorite massage wands. This is, I'll set this one down. This is the first one and I just thought this was so pretty. It reminds me of like the Caribbean um, waters. Just so pretty. The rainbows, all of that. I can't wait to um, try these out. Massages are like everything. Especially because my back is always like really, really attitudinal. This is the second fluorite. Just as green, a little darker though. 
and I just thought this was so pretty. I've not seen a fluorite this green, let alone in a massage tool. This also reminded me of something like from the islands, maybe like Key West or I don't know, Jamaica. This would be my Jamaica stone, but so pretty. I absolutely love it. Y'all, I hope this um, visual is clear because like I'm getting a lot of incense smoke and I really don't want it to affect the visual. So anyway, this is my fluorite wand or a fluorite massage stone. I thought this was so pretty, so gorgeous, of course, because of this deep purple. So this is how I initially saw it. And I was like, what? What is that? I want it. I thought it was amethyst. Nope, it's fluorite. And I am not mad about it. I love it. The rainbows, oh my gosh. Just so pretty. All over funny thing is I actually had purchased and paid for everything and then I saw these last and I was like um yep so you're totally gonna have to re-swipe my card because <laughs> I want these and they're coming with me okay let me grab the other set of crystals I'll just leave them behind me again I hope the visual is clear y'all just let me know okay so this is, of course, my amethyst point. It is a raw amethyst point, and when I saw this, I just wanted to eat it up. I thought it looked like a frozen, um, what do they used to call it? Like um, honey dripper. I don't know if any of you know much about that, but honey drippers used to be the absolute junk back then. I loved it. You freeze your favorite juice or like mix your favorite Kool-Aids, put it in the freezer, let it set, take it out, and you got you a good old icy. Absolutely love this. So thought this was really, really pretty, real dope. Um, it has a lot of smoky in it too, and that was another reason why I just absolutely loved it. And it's just so cold and chill in my hand. Can't get enough of it. But that is my amethyst point. And for my finale, I'm gonna go ahead and set these to the side so I can begin. Uh-oh throwing my stuff around all right y'all so here we have my amethyst flower i was thinking amethyst cluster but they call it an amethyst flower and i love it so pretty oh my god like look at that absolutely gorgeous just stunning okay let's set that there so this is my next amethyst flower it's more of a matte purple but it's still really dark and I still really love that so I can't wait to see what I'm gonna do with this. I really, really like this. So pretty. And then of course you hear my nails scraping against it, so. Okay. <laughs> Here is the next amethyst flower. So far three are in the mix. I thought this was so cute. I'm totally going to be carrying this one around. It also uh, looks really yummy. Gosh, I just can't handle this. I cannot deal 
Why are they so delicious looking? Okay, moving on. Here is a much lighter amethyst. Really, really pretty. So there was a little piece right here, but while I was cleaning my amethyst, it kind of broke off. So I was just like, oh, well, guess it wasn't supposed to be there. I don't know. But this is my lavender <laughs> amethyst flower. Sit that there. And last but not least for forever and always because I obviously don't know how to stop buying crystals. <laughs> we have oh, my last amethyst flower and this one actually has crystals all around it so front to back top not much the bottom but you get the point so this is my amethyst flower so pretty Well, I hope you all enjoyed this lovely video. Um, it wasn't as quick as I was thinking it was going to be, but you know how I do. So don't judge me. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching. I love each and every one of you all. Thank you so much for rocking with me and supporting me continuously. Crystal kisses and royal blessings. Have a blessed rest of your day.